Hi guys and welcome to The Colorful Gardener. My name is Josh and today I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to protect your plants as we head into warmer weather. But first, if you're new here and you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscription button so you can get more gardening tips and tutorials to improve your garden. So today I want to show you a simple trick that will keep your plants protected as we head into warmer weather. And to do that, I create these cages out of chicken wire to protect my plants. So they're very simple. They're about a foot tall and about two feet wide around. And what I do is I use these for whenever I am putting out new plants to protect them. Well, a couple of years ago, I had rabbits and they were eating my plants like crazy from vegetables to dahlias to anything that was edible for rabbits, they would eat them. So I got so tired and fed up with it. I finally came up with these to put around my plants to make sure they were not getting eaten by the rabbits. What I also found out, these are great for keeping your dogs and cats from digging up your plants. Also, this also keeps kids and yourself from walking on the plants. So it's a great barrier for young new plants that you're trying to get established and you don't want to destroy and you took the time to plant and so now I want to go ahead and show you how I made these. So what I have here is literally just a roll of chicken wire that I purchased from the big box store down the road. And uh, I can make about 50 of these wire cages for 10 bucks. And it's about two feet tall. And what I'll do is I'll come down the center and that will be the part where I cut the top part. And then I'll measure out two feet to make sure I get a nice circle and I can put use this cage around large plants if I need to. Um, so let's go ahead and I'll just show you how to do that real quick. By the way, it's great to use stones when you are putting this out because it likes to curl up. Okay, so I have about two feet measured out and so I'm gonna cut it out to here. So all I'm gonna do now is take the ends and I'm going to weave them together so they'll stay together. You could use wire or strings, but it's really not needed because these are pretty, uh, the bits, the metal bits on the ends are pretty strong. So all I gotta do is just bend these back over each other. Okay, so we have the finished product. We have here is a one foot tall by two feet around chicken wire cage to put on around um, your new plants to keep them from getting eaten by rabbits and small children from running on them and keep yourself from walking on your new plants. Uh, I really like these in my garden. I think they can really benefit you. I've never had one that's been broken and I can't reuse it. Um, I've had like, I've got like 50 of them now and I can just keep reusing these year after year once a plant has established itself. All you need to do now is just get a bamboo stake and run it through the chicken wire and it'll keep it in place. Below my feet I have some dahlia sprouts that are coming out which are prime dinner for rabbits as uh, spring approaches and I want to make sure that these dahlia sprouts are protected um, so I can have lots of blooms this year in my garden. So using the new cage that I've created I'm going to go ahead and just put it right down on ar around the dahlia sprouts that are coming up. And that's pretty much it. You could also use different other types of uh, fencing to create these, any type of metal that are uh, pliable so you can bend them to the shape. But like I said, this is just one feet tall by two feet around. These, got, these last for a long time. I've had these for years and I just keep making more and more of them for all the new plants I'm putting out into my garden. I hope this tutorial has been helpful for you as you enter spring this year. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Josh and this is The Colorful Gardener.